Now the following footage is something that I have been intending to deal with for a long time now because I'm just getting sick to death of people putting videos up that are defending evil people. Totally, totally, utterly evil people. This is one such video. Let us show you what I mean. Oh, by the way, we're not talking about the police. Not talking about the police. Either. Talking about these two, these pair. These are an utter disgrace to the human race. Utter disgrace. Vermin. Thousands of persons, individuals, men, women and children, within the reformation of the middle ages laid down their lives so that people like this and this can have freedom from papal Rome and its autocracy that vile and violent system Once that violent system was broken and freedom spread out, then of course we've got the First World War, Second World War, created by governments, not by the people, but by governments. It's always by the governments. And then they send us out to fight on their behalf, having caused the trouble in the first place. And when it is said that the United Kingdom or America won this war, won that war, no they didn't. They did not. People now go round and say, well America said they won this Second World War, no they didn't, British won the Second World War, nobody fucking won any, any of these frigging wars. It's not a nation that won the war, it's the people that won the war. The civilians and the soldiers, not pissing Parliament, and not this government and that government and every, every other frigging government, it's the soldiers and the munitions workers and the factory workers. That's who won the war. Not a nation, a people joined together. And they lay down their lives so that the freedom that we have could remain. Second to that, there's all the civil unrests in our country. For a start, I'm not talking of, even about America. I mean, the amount of there, good gracious, fighting the government. But in England, fighting the government, time after time after time after time, in order to retain the freedom that the government continually wants to take from us. And this generation now has given up. Well, it's never even picking started. Okay, and we get louts like this and louts like that abusing the freedom of all the blood spent, spent by people on the ground, spilt. They are a disgrace. And yet, uploaders defend these bastards. <coughs> <coughs> 
reported to have been armed. And we have a accomplice over here. Let's go back to see if we can get him. There he is, armed. So the police have turned up, quite rightly, armed. This drunkard and his mate want to stagger across and challenge the police because they've got nothing better to do. They're wasters. They feed off our taxes. They want us to support their wasteful lives. They will not take responsibility for their lives. Lefties come along and make excuses for them. Lefties come along and say that officers are, have just attacked them. Well, they haven't. These have attacked the officers. Because this is an attack upon officers. Yo, you miss why you don't get shot, bro? He's in trouble. But he's drunk. That's it, get down. Whoa. There was a time when this fella, he wouldn't have been pushed down, he'd have been truncheoned, quite rightly so, and hurled off into the cells with his drunken mate. Quite rightly so. Whilst we are slaving away and we're paying our taxes, these bastards, and that's all they are, Are living of our frigging earnings because tax is our earnings. Where do you think tax comes from? It comes from our earnings. So it's part of our earnings. And these bastards here want to live off it and people want to support these persons. Okay, if you want to support these persons and justify them and say the police are wrong here, which the police are not wrong here, he's the one that started it and they're the buggers that finished it. If you're supporting these, then you go to these persons, open your wallet on a daily basis or a weekly basis and give them your money. Don't give them our money. We don't want these pissing wasters. Every person has a responsibility for their own actions and for their own lives. These are total, utter wasters. They should be locked up and then transferred to rehab. And told to grow up, sober up, be a man, be profitable to society, stop sponging on us. It's about time these persons were kicked to the ground. He didn't, he just big and fell. He was pushed and fell. He was not in a state, this chap, to stand up in the first place. Drunken bum. Well, as we say, if persons want to uphold this sort of thing, these two drunkards, they're probably on drugs as well. These low lowlifes, sponging off us. You take them on board. Do you know, I once said to a minister, so-called minister, a minister who's a toss, who's a liar, who's cheated, who's a frigging robber, who's no minister, he was campaigning, his name was Tims, campaigning to have Mara Hindley released. I said to him, oh, okay, I agree. I agree. When Mara Hindley killed those children with Ian Brady, you know, Keith Bennett and uh, Leslie Ann Downey and a couple of others. That's in the past. Okay, you say it's in the past, that's in the past. She served her time. Okay, fair enough. I agree, she should be released. Into your custody. 
not into mine, not into the taxpayers, into your custody. You're campaigning for them. You house her. You clothe her. You give her money. You give her food. You look after her. Oh no. This pissing left winger. Oh no. And this is how they are in society. The left wing sit down and want us to, to carry the burden that they impose upon us. They won't do it if they're so passionate to have people like this protected. Let them get the pig in wallets out. Let them put their money where their mouths are. Simple as that. I'll leave these two wasters. And by the way, if anybody here thinks I'm for the police, uh, another thing picking coming. Another thing coming. Me and the police. Have a relationship? Oh yes. <clears throat> We've had a relationship for years. The police and I, they hate me and I hate them. They try to get me to court and I've got me to court in some cases and failed to prosecute because I haven't got the evidence. And I've taken them to court and prosecuted them and I've had the evidence. And now they won't even pick and turn up. Oh, it's trouble down here, you know, they won't turn up for me. <laughs> we have this love, love relationship. I love to prosecute the bastards, and they love to prosecute me. <laughs> there are some good officers, mind you, but um, <laughs> it is funny, you know. It is funny. Um, so, we'll leave it at that. <laughs>